Hey guys, it's Brandon, creator of Happily Dressed, a fashion blog dedicated to self-acceptance, self-confidence, and self-sufficiency, and welcome back to the channel. I've actually filmed about two or three YouTube videos in like the last two months, but got right to the end of editing them and was like, you know what, mm, I don't like my room. It just, it just looks like my room. So I set up this side of my room to be like a sewing corner. You get a great little view, it's fun, I'm rambling. Let me just tell you what today's video is all about. Ooh, look at that, some fancy lighting. Basically, I've had my singer Heavy Duty. This is the 4423. I've had this bad boy for four years now. I bought it back in December of 2017 because I wanted to start altering the clothes that I thrifted. Lo and behold, four years later, I have a whole YouTube channel about <laughs> sewing real garments, which is really cool. But this machine has seen me through so many amazing projects. Most of them are on YouTube. The rest are on my Instagram. Singer has been such a great sewing brand for me to start sewing with back in 2017. And it's still such a trooper today in 2021 that I'm so excited to announce Singer and I are partnering up. So basically what I'm saying is that I am now an ambassador for Singer. And to wrap this partnership up with a bow, they sent me this bad boy. They sent me the Singer 6800 Heavy Duty. So this is the computerized heavy duty machine there are so many amazing things about this machine. I like have it open, but I literally just opened it before I started filming just to see. And I was like, you know what? I should film this. This is a monumental moment for the channel, for my sewing journey. I need to document this. So I paused immediately, got my camera out and started filming. But yeah, they sent me this machine. I am so excited. It does so many amazing things. Like I, like I said, I love this machine. It has been with me through thick and thin through literally every project that I've ever sewn. But to upgrade and to make it even better, I like cried happy tears the other day. To have Singer send me this is so amazing. It means the world to me. The only thing I truly wanna do on this channel is inspire everyone to get out there and do what makes them happy and do it in a great way. And if that's sewing, then you're at the right place. And if not, I hope that this channel gives you inspiration to go out and find what your thing is and go out and do it for you. Literally just for you. Let's take this apart. Let's replace this bad boy. I mean, it still works. <laughs> but yeah, let's open this bad boy up and see what it's all about. All right, I tried to get it out before. I probably had to stand up. You're gonna see a lot of peach, but it's okay. So we have the dust cloth. We have the presser foot, which is cool because with this machine, you don't even need the presser foot. You can like use it, it's computerized. You can use it without the presser foot, which I think is so wild. Oh wow, so fancy. It says it has 586 stitch applications, which is so crazy. Oh wow, it already comes threaded, that's neat. Enhanced piercing power because it is heavy duty. Extra high sewing speed, which we love. I will say if you start sewing though, go slow. Learn patience. It's very important for sewing. And it even has this function that'll do like lettered stitching, which I think is pretty cool. But yeah, here's an overview of the machine. So this is what it'll like cut your threads for you. This is what will knot your threads for you. This is to put the needle down. Um, this is to sew without the presser foot, I believe. This is plastic that will now come off. This is to back stitch. And then here we have all our little buttons and controls, which I will learn as I start sewing. This is so neat. And then this is where you would keep all your little extra stuff that it came with. I just put it right in there. Bobbin, real thread, all this good stuff. Oh, this is how you can control the sewing speed if you want to go really fast. If you want to stay at a moderate speed. Wow. Super cool. Super cool. So I figured a great way to debut this bad boy right here would be to sew something with it. And actually recently I just finished this project. You guys know I'm always finding cool things at the thrift store. And this used to be a drape. And I made this cool shirt. I'll actually put it on now. So I made this shirt the other day, which is pretty cool because like it ties, like you can tie it in the front if you wanted to. You can tie it in the back. You can tie these up in knots on the side. So I thought it'd be cool to give this machine a test run and sew some pants. So let's do that. So I started off by cleaning off the area. This space is still new and it'll probably change throughout every video you see, but I'm pretty happy with it. And that table fits my cutting board almost perfectly. I'm plugging in the machine, getting the table in place. Oh my God, look how happy he is. <laughs> I'm so excited for the new machine. I'm cutting out all my pattern pieces. I kind of just like skipped the part where I'm like, hey, I have a new pant pattern, LOL. I know you guys are wanting another video for that. <laughs> it's coming, maybe. <laughs> but I have all the pieces cut off. And then next, all I did was serge them all. I also have a singer serger, so <laughs> still on brand, babes. I just surged. It's like the longest part of the video. 
but now I'm threading the new machine. It was so easy, oh my gosh. I love the bobbin thingy wheel thing. It's like so effortless to put in a new bobbin. But basically, I just spent the whole day sewing these pants together. Also, I think it's really important to mention that I think I have perfected my zipper fly method and I am very excited to share that with you guys super soon just because I've made like three pairs of pants now with the zipper method and it's turned out really, really good. So excited to share that. But yeah, let's finish these pants and see what's happening. All right, so this is the try on portion where I realized, okay, kind of liking the fit, kind of don't like the pockets in the front. The pockets in the back are decent. The length is a little wide. It still needs a waistband, but I'm tired. All right, guys, it is the next day. I had to go to work, then I came home, and I made this hat so I could have finished the pants. Isn't it amazing? Okay, so here are the pants so far. They're literally done. I slid them down in the legs, so they're a little wide. I just have to hem the bottom, but I did run into an issue trying to put on the buttonhole. I'll make this quick. My pant pattern worked well with like heavier weight fabrics. This is such a loose, like lightweight linen, if not pseudo linen, so I think that it needs an elastic waist. Like I would have been better off not putting a zipper in there and having an elastic waist, but I think I actually might put an elastic waist in there and have a zipper. That's kind of beneficial, right? Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I am so excited about my new machine and to be a partner with Singer Sewing Company and to be able to use this bad boy for all my future projects. I mean, it made that hat. This guy helped me make this guy and it was pretty simple, like so easy to do. Um, there's gonna be a matching vest with this too. If you do want to purchase yourself a sewing machine or anything else from the Singer website, you can use the code HAPPILY10 in the USA and then HAPPILY10CA in Canada to get 10% off your purchase. But until next time, I'll catch you all in my next video. See you guys later.